This is Celine reporting for Kids First, and today I'll be reviewing the film Living. Living illustrates that films are not just a source of entertainment. They can make us examine social awareness, consciousness, and our values. This film tells a heartbreaking story about a bureaucrat who learns he has a terminal illness and is then galvanized to make a difference in his life and in those around him. Mr. Williams, played by Bill Nye, is a civil servant in 1950s London whose life is one of dull routine. Once he is notified that he has roughly six months remaining, he realizes that he no longer knows how to enjoy life and has become trapped in a meaningless existence. He attaches himself to others to observe life and thus make changes from his friendship with his subordinate Miss Harris, Amy Lou Wood, who notably adds spark to the movie and his life. He enjoys her appetite for life and remembers what it is to be alive. This realization motivates him to return to work and make important changes. Living is a historical drama with splendid costuming and detailing all the various sets used throughout the film. Every minute detail under director Oliver Hermanis provides the viewer immersion into this period piece. Costume designer Sandy Powell, along with the various artists who work on hair and makeup, support the depth of this story. Bill Nighy gives a compelling performance as a man who resurrects his life, and I particularly enjoyed his singing in this movie. The film's message is that it is never too late to change the direction of your life and to influence those around you. Mr. Williams remembers not to push things under the rug and not to shy away from responsibility. It is an important message and reminder to us to live life to the fullest. There are no scenes that younger viewers cannot watch, but the seriousness of the film and topic does not lend itself to younger viewers. I give Living 3.5 out of 5 stars and recommend it for ages 12 to 18, plus adults. This movie is available in select theaters now. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel to watch all my next interviews and reviews and those of our many other talented Kids First reporters. Catch you next time. Bye now.